Once the Chinese webpage wrote that Europe has history and Asia has heritage. But since then, we have heritage everywhere. Cultural heritage as a concept explains us how contemporary societies shape their identities using what has remained from their own past. As a rich and flexible concept, it creates meeting points for various branches of the humanities, the social sciences, as well as the creative arts. Our students may join the program from various academic backgrounds, such as archaeology, ethnography, anthropology, political sciences, and literary studies. I think this interdisciplinarity is a great asset for both professors and uh, students of our department. I come from a background of uh, heritage and cultural anthropology. I'm an art historian, a bachelor and master's degree. I am a musician and uh, I always was interested in preserving um, traditional music and uh, that's why I came here. Yeah. I have achieved already a bachelor degree in architecture and a master degree in urban architectural heritage. I was interested in the European approach because uh, I live in Asian part of Russia since that I was interested in the new approaches. I wanted something new, which was uh, uh, what, which was the international experiences to get it. I chose Alte because I knew that Alte uh, was one of the leading universities in Hungary already. So I was happy to find the uh, department in here. It was actually not me who chose Alte, but Alte who chose me. I would propose the, the program for all people that uh, are really enthusiastic about uh, a uh, very intricate uh, intellectual and uh, academic uh, understanding of, of heritage as a part of a more complex, namely geographical, historical, anthropological point of view and uh, to understand uh, the phenomena in a more like uh, bird's view uh, position. Cultural heritage studies are the best option for those um, who would like to remain in the field of humanities, who would like to work in the scope of culture, but who are looking at the same time a profession beyond teaching and research. I think the knowledge that we are taking here is quite uh, international. I'm, I, I feel like I can use it in, my, uh, in Turkey or anywhere else. I learned a lot about heritage interpretation and uh, the the ways to interact with heritage and uh, to treat heritage as a part of uh, everyday social um, background. Our department is very friendly and uh, we really uh, feel like we are the family members of this department. They are really nice and good. I am really excited to be here to study and explore the city because it's really um, old city with the beautiful architecture and uh, beautiful people. Uh, I feel like it's, it is my hometown. This just takes my breath. It's very beautiful. It's an inspiring place to be in. So here you will learn about theory of cultural heritage, the methodology, how to analyze cultural heritage, but there's also a very practical part of it, how to write a successful cultural application. So if you're a historian, sociologist, anthropologist, biologist, genetic heritage, geologist, natural heritage, or a lawyer or a jurist, you are most welcome because heritage now is everything.